The question is if sin alpha equal to 1 by 2 and cos beta equal to 1 by 2 then the value of alpha plus beta equal to question mark. So sin alpha equal to 1 by 2 means sin 30 degree. So we can cut sin sin therefore alpha equal to 30 degree. Now cos beta equal to 1 by 2 the value of cos 60 degree equal to 1 by 2 therefore we can cut cos cos therefore beta equal to 60 degree now alpha plus beta equal to 30 plus 60 therefore 90 degree next question is if cot theta equal to 1 by root 3 then the value of 6 square theta plus cos 6 square theta is so cot theta equal to 1 by root 3 so cot 60 degree so we can cut cot cot therefore theta equal to 60 degree so now 6 square theta plus cos square theta equal to 6 square 60 degree plus cos square 60 degree equal to the value of 6 square theta equal to 2 square plus the value of cos square theta equal to 2 by root 3 whole square 2 square equal to 4 and 2 by root 3 whole square equal to 4 by 3 the LCM will be 3 and 12 plus 4 equal to 16 by 3 5 and 1 by 3 so that is the answer. The question is if tan 5x plus 30 degree equal to 1 then find the value of x. So we can write here like tan 5x plus 30 degree equal to 1. That means that tan 45 degree. So we can cut tan tan therefore 5x plus 30 equal to 45 so 5x equal to 45 minus 30 so 5x equal to 15 so we can cut it by 3 so x equal to 3 this is the answer next question is if sin 3x plus 30 degree equal to root 3 by 2 then find the value of 5x plus 10 so in here sin 3x plus 30 equal to root 3 by 2 it means that sin 60 degree so we can cut sin sin so 3x plus 30 equal to 60 3x equal to 60 minus 30 so 3x equal to 30 and we can cut it by 10 so x equal to 10 now 5x plus 10 it means that 5 into 10 plus 10 so we will do it that means that 50 plus 10 equal to 60 so this is the answer the question is if 4 cos theta equal to 11 sin theta find the value of 11 cos theta minus 7 sin theta by 11 cos theta plus 7 sin theta so now 4 cos theta equal to 11 sin theta so we can write it by cos theta by 11 equal to sin theta by 4 so we can get it by constant k and therefore cos theta equal to 11 k and sin theta equal to 4k so we will put the value in here so therefore 11 into the value of cos theta equal to 11k minus 7 into the value of sin theta equal to 4k by 11 into 11k plus 7 into 4k so 11 11 the 121 k minus 28k by 121k 
plus 28k so that means that 121 plus 28 equal to 149 and 121 minus 28 equal to 93 so we can cut k by k therefore 93 by 149 this is the answer